Right. Jamie, thanks for joining us. That was um, a pretty good way to mark your 100th appearance, wasn't it? Yeah, it's, um, it's been a frustrating old season this year, but um, you know, we've been building, we've been building about two weeks now of, of, of a few of the younger boys really showing us how it's done last week and on you know, Monday night as well. So you know, we knew we came out here, we had you know, Worcester, a good team. They've, they've, they've had some, some good performance, especially at home. So point to prove and um, you know, it wasn't perfect by any means, but I think we, we proved it to ourselves and it's, uh, it's a happy Christmas now came out in that first half and you played most of the rugby you didn't get the tries that you probably deserved but um, kicking the points down bigger and kept that scoreboard ticking over didn't he? Yeah it's been something we've talked about you know we want to make sure we're brave with our decisions we want to make sure we when we feel we've got a chance we go for the jugular we go for the points but at the end of the day you keep pressure on and you know rugby's a it's a tough sport these days and um you know teams are good you know every team can defend for 50 60 70 minutes so you know especially away from home we knew we had we had to start building the building the scoreboard keep the pressure on them and, and then when, when it cracks that's when you take your opportunities and we thought we did that today It's funny you talk about tackling and uh, defending um, you boys didn't miss a tackle in that first half is that just characteristic of the performance you put in? Yeah as you said we, we were on top you know, we were in control um, Yeah, and it, it t- takes time for the scoreboard to build but you know, when we had the ball we looked dangerous and when they had the ball we contained them and, you know, we, we talked all week about the fact that you know, 9, 10, uh, back 3 they've got some really dangerous players and then a the 4-back can carry the ball hard so you know, we knew that we had to win, win the collisions, win the confrontation, and, and that was that, that really sort of was the, the big building block for us. And in that second half, when you're under the pump, you're defending strongly again, and then someone picks off the ball and goes 95 metres. How much of a boost yeah, is that? Yeah, uh, well, as I said, you know, rugby's given momentum, and you know, that first 50 minutes of the second half, Worcester came out firing. You know, we made a few mistakes. You know, they started to build, build positives, and we, we built negatives. And then we said, you know, at some point something was going to change, and. You know, defending on your own five metre line, you know, even then it didn't feel too, too too dangerous. Too, we felt relatively comfortable, and I suppose that made them push that extra pass because they wanted to to, to hit the killer blow. And you know, Cobus is pretty quick when he catches the ball. Luth is the same, um, and you know we get clean pair of his, and suddenly you're thirty points up. Talk to us about that hundred appearance mark you've just hit. A pretty special evening. Yeah, it's been it's been a it's been a special week in, week in many ways. Um, you know, actually my first game was uh, was here in six ways. Um, you know, it's my third club. Um, you know, fourth season here, so I've, I've racked up the games pretty quickly. But you know, it's a special club. Um, you know, it's a very, very good squad. You know, the atmosphere is that everything's heading in the right direction this year. And you know, um, I've got some special memories here, and this will be another one of them. Jamie, well done, enjoy the win. Perfect, thanks very much.